guys, Wilder Lewis here and today we have got another video for you guys. As you can see, I'm stood in front of Old Trafford. You guys have asked for it. Uh, it's been a few years. It is time to do the Manchester United Mega Store Tour and shirt buying video. So without further ado, let's get inside. Right guys, entrance is just here, let's go inside. Right guys, inside now, always greeted with the uh, goalkeeper kit for the respective season. And it's in a yellow design. Guys, this is the new home kit for this season. Now sponsored by Team Viewer, so a different sponsor from Chevrolet. What do you guys think of it? Also got the training top for this season as well. Nice red and the grey design. It's fifty pounds that. Very nice. Nice material. Each of the kits available in the uh, the long sleeve versions for those cold winter months. Stood at Old Trafford. Always you need your socks. Here in there, it's the normal Man United colour variation. Thirteen pounds. In the winter, it can get very cold on European nights. So, um, what hat, do you need for that? You hat, need a Manchester United hat. Hats, gloves are a necessity. You can feed the glazers all your money in this shop. There's no price on that one, is it? Uh, Twenty-two pounds. So yeah, twenty-two pounds for that one. There you go. Obviously, they don't allow you into Old Trafford with a bag, so you won't be able to get that inside the stadium. Which is a bit of a... But it's 35 quid if you want to buy it. Right guys, these shirts have the name and the numbers of the players on them. So we've got one here featuring the Champions League. There's one up here featuring the Premier League with now no room for racism on the side. Mm. On this wall here we have some facts actually about the shirt and uh, its benefits etc. Didn't you used to wear one of those? Yeah. <laughs> so you can be a United supporter from any age. Um, yeah. I'd like to see you fit in that now. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, didn't that include these shorts as well? And that is a good price. How much is that? £38. Pounds. 38 quid. Feel little. 
Always good to keep hydrated on and off the pitch, so a water bottle is another must. And how much is that, Lewis? That is... I don't want to be, I don't want to be mean. Let's see, we've got a price tag. Is that a side one? I have no idea. Maybe there's one on there. Maybe there's one. Oh, here we go, I found it. Ten English pounds for your water bottle. My tip is, take your own flask. So this is Match United's away kit for this season, featuring a bright blue design. What are your thoughts on it? Uh, it's, it's very retro. Yeah, it's got a retro feel to it. Retro feel nice. to it. Uh, I'm not too sure. It'll probably go well with a pair of blue jeans. Uh, I'm not too sure if I'd turn up to watch a game in the full kit. £68 for that. Although I'm guessing that's £68 because you've got the, uh, the number and the, the, all the various badges on. So you're paying for the extras on the, with the shirt and the printing. Got to have the socks. The always on. Yeah. Thirteen quid for the socks. Eh? They're not bad. Again, if you're little and likes the colour blue, then uh, perfect for them. And this time, if you don't like red, you have a black water bottle design. If you don't want regular sunglasses, you can go the United way and pay up £165 for some Mayu Gym. I hope I pronounced that right. Um, sunglasses. Um, Going to have require deep pockets for this. Is it worth it? I don't know. Of training stuff here, got jackets, t shirts, shorts, classes, hoodies to suit everyone's taste. If you go right up close to this, it does your eyes in. week they'll be selling Raphael Varane shirts in here. Be a good uh, name to have on your shirts. The nice gazelle shoe. Good to uh, go to games in this one. 75 pounds. Again for cold nights, hat and a Man United scarf is um, always, always necessary. Nice little combo that. Let's look at that. Is there a price in there? No price tag. Don't ever find them. Well, 25 English pounds. 25 quid for a nice scarf and hat combo. Is this the Lego? Now, this. Let's see what you now this, man at Lego, £250. Is it worth it? I don't think so. I don't know. Let, let me know your thoughts. Yeah. It's very nice, but um, it requires deep pockets and deep patience, I would say. That is quite nice. Whoa, and it moves. That's cute. Oh. That's not included, by the way. You want apps? They've got apps. Plenty to choose from. Right, guys, here we have some more training gear. Um, in a black and white variation. Most 
most importantly, we have some Manchester United footballs. And these ones featuring the signatures of the team. We've got the Hayes there, Bailly, uh, Holly, Holly the man himself. That one retails for. I think it's a lack price tag, you know. Um, that probably be in the region about fifteen pounds, I would say. I'd imagine. Some standard white ones here. That will probably get muddy very quickly, though. That's twelve pounds, so I'd imagine that's about fifteen, possibly. Some more baby here. Very cute, I must say. Price tag of twenty-five. Twenty-five quid. No, it's not going to fit you. Put it to a look. Nah, it's, nah. I'd say it was a bit too small. I want to dress fashionable for the game. We have some Manchester United branded ties. As worn by Alan Keegan. And obviously up here in times of COVID-19, we have some face masks with a variation as shown up here. Old Trafford, I'm sure, what some people would like to do, which is actually for kids, but um, get into a um, dressing gown or something and relax. <laughs> Again, this is for um, ages 4 to 5, not quite. Ages 4 to 5, not 14 to 15. If you want to date yourself back a few decades, we've got an old style football club dating back 1878, over 100 years ago, that. I mean, it's, it is quite light, but you can imagine that, like, 80 years ago or whatever, that would be, like, Lock. three times as heavy. And probably explains why a lot of people, a lot of old, older players uh, suffer from uh, uh, brain injuries. Uh, and it's, obviously, that's a different conversation. Some more hats and gym bags. Uh, nice black and orange design. That's reduced. That was £22. It's now eight pounds. Uh, not bad. It's not bad. It's a bit of a bargain. Then behind we have some um, soft toys for little kids. This. I do believe you've had some of these in your Past. childhood, maybe. I'm Have not too sure. Amateurs. Thirteen pounds. That's probably about five pounds when yeah. I got them back in the day. Again, very nice. <laughs> Um, some things for your bedroom, so you've got a clock, um, a book, football. Obviously, Casey Stoney uh, used to be the manager of the, uh, the women's team. So if you go on the museum tour, you get a certificate when you come out of it with your name on. On the date that you went on the tour, obviously this one's uh, got a mason print signed with it. I mean, get this, suddenly a footballer is booked by one matter. Got a signature on the back. And it's quote, football is not just played with the feet, but with the head, and that's 20 pounds. If you go to Desco and you see a dairy milk chocolate bar, and you think that's not good enough for me, come to Old Trafford and you can get a limited club edition chocolate bar. Well, I don't know what the, what the price point for that is. How oh, much is this beast? There doesn't seem to be a price in that one. But you can probably buy a bar of chocolate for about a quid. In your local supermarket, I would suggest that's probably about six or seven quid because you get the United logo with it. And also we have some uh, takeaway mugs here and some just normal mugs going down as well. Obviously uh, these are got bear all the sponsorship, obviously. Is that Melissa? Yeah, Melissa. Yeah. Obviously. Got some keyrings and pin badges here, including an air freshener. Um, some nice um, pin badges here. 
It's quite a nice little set. 15 quid for that. It's quite nice actually. Obviously the iconic man Fred the Red. Fred the Red. Can't miss him. United bash down here. Manchester United. A nice foot football design one. Just some more men's casual United wear. Too bad. So we have the water bottles as shown before, including a twin back uh, wristband. Six quid for a couple of sweatbands there. Probably maybe a cheap uh, the trick would be uh, just take some uh, tissue paper and wipe your head with that. Save you six quid. Uh, some shin guards or shin pads, whatever you want to call them. And uh, if if you were Jack, Jack Grealish, they'd probably be half size ones. <laughs> Including if your idol is David De Gea, then um, some goalkeeper gloves. Uh, sometimes it slips through the fingers. Is this actually coming from? I think it does, yeah. So you've got a actually nice training set here with um, a football, whatever that is, and then some cones, all for £25. Not too bad. Going back to school in September, we've got some um, watches up here. How much is, uh, how much is that? Uh, £25. Don't make the price tag very big. Um, obviously, some pens, uh, starter sets, stationary set. And then the ultimate, ultimate stationery set down there. Every child should have one. Yeah, how much does that retail for? Fourteen pounds. Not actually that bad, to be fair. So we've actually last season's kit here for sale in the form of a uh, kids one at a reduced price. Obviously, it was thirty-eight pounds. Now fifteen pounds. Some ladies sportswear over here, um, featuring jacket, t-shirt, chuckies, hoodies, etc. Et Got some um, trainers over here. Uh, seem to be all Adidas. I think they've got kids' sizes for Dan James as well. Possibly. <laughs> See, featuring a nice, um, a nice colour, obviously. Whatever colour you want, yeah. Whatever colour they are. Yeah. Here we see one. Fun. Sponsoring it. With his nice. Over here, uh, stood and non-studded ones. Uh, fortunately, only seem to be showcasing ones of type of colour. We've got a few variations though. Fancy a drink? Then Man United have got you covered. Posters, how much it is? Five pounds. It's quite a nice uh, pint glass. Pint right? glass, yeah. yeah. Nine English pounds. And then here, well, this is this is proper Man United nizing the experience. Uh, with some shaving equipment here. Mm, which one should I have? I know. Right. Obviously, if you're under, under 10, you're probably not going to be using this product unless there are children's versions, which <laughs> I don't think there are. So, uh, but you can get anything here. You know. Anything you can get. You want to buy your dad anything. You can get him a, a for 50, pounds. 50 quid for a multi grooming set. Obviously, if you don't like United, just go to Boots or other well known outlet that sells non branded shavers. Following the trend, we've got um, hair dryer and uh, straighteners. Oh, my days. 
Massachusetts. It doesn't look that bad, but it How doesn't much is that? have to be United brand again. <laughs> How much is that? That is 70, 70, no, 70 pounds. Is it Obviously, worth it, guys? If you've got straight straight hair, then probably best to pull that back. If your, if your hair's a bit curly, then that's your ideal product. Some more United stuff over here, including that is just there with the branding. Um, what is Crest flag? This. Um, then we've got the street signs, which you can hang this up in your bedroom. So that goes be way. And then we've got um, Xbox and PS4 Man United skins. How much are the skins? Skins, this is PS4, PS5, I think. Mean, £25. Mm, is that PS5? PS4, that is actually. PS4. I don't think they've got one for PS5. And a uh, yeah, Matt no. Busby. Matt Busby DVD. Some more Man United gear, I suppose. What's this? Is this the, the golf, golf, golf club? Golf, golf gloves? Yeah. yeah, I think so. This is, this is the golf accessory, so you've got your golf shoes. Uh, a hybrid head cover. Quite nice, actually. Not that bad, to be honest. Yeah, umbrella. Always got to have an umbrella. Always have to carry an umbrella in Manchester. Let's head our way to the print shop. Just buying the
guys, finished product. We've got cola on the side there, and then we've got Premier League and Logan for races in here on the side. Very nice jersey for this season. You'll see me wearing this for most games. When it gets cold though, I probably won't be wearing it. <laughs> Right guys, hope you enjoyed our tour of the mega store once again. It's been a while, first time in our, how long was it? About two years. Two years. Um, but yeah, obviously ended up with our Man United jersey for this season, so um, very nice to get. So uh, yeah, we'll be back here on Saturday for the uh, Everton friendly, the last friendly before the new season starts uh, against Leeds. So that, that's going to be a good game, that is full capacity as well. But uh, yes, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to drop a like and a comment. And uh, yeah, see you next time.